Hello everyone, it's me again, GW Fan the Sock Corbroni, welcoming you back to Let's Play Equestria Bound. Since last time I rearranged my items a bit, looks much cleaner now that I have a second uh, party member to carry it all. I've given my for sale sign, the magic caramel, and the bomb to Sweetie Belle. Not that I really am gonna, you know, use the bo well. You know what, actually, never mind. I just now thought of a reason to use the bomb, so... Uh, anyway, I've also given her the hard hat because she needs defense really badly. If I forgot to say so last time... <laughs> yeah, she doesn't have very good HP in defense. Uh, or offense, for that matter. Not that you're really going to be using it that much anyway. Okay, great. Yeah, not that you're really going to be using it that much anyway, but the amount of, you know, MP she's eventually going to get. But, uh, you know, it's still good to have because it's still factored into whether or not you can, you know, get an instant uh, you win effect. So, and then I'll get a Holmes hat for Dinky since she no longer has the, uh, the hard hat there. So, yeah, even with this... Yeah, 31, 27, yeah, still doesn't have, uh... Yeah, Sweetie Belle's still lacking in defense. And she's also much lower level, but that'll be... That'll... We'll solve that pretty quickly here. Once we go into, uh... This place. And that mole is, like, there, like, pretty much 100% of the time. I, you very rarely ever don't meet it. <laughs> so, anyway, the mole playing rough. Which, uh, isn't very dangerous, uh, as all you need to do is cast the extremely awesome Winter Alpha spell. Oh, and he'll just make himself feel strange. He could hit you, but he doesn't... he tends to not do it terribly often. I love that. Maybe I should have hit him with Dinky just to show you how hard that she can hit. But anyway... Alright, HP, MP, nice. Offense, speed, IQ, needed that. MP. And we get Fire Alpha. And that's nice. I'll show that in a moment. Oh, nice. Offense up. Jeez. Wow. Defense plus two. I was, wasn't really expecting that. IQ. Good. More. HP. MP. Okay. Cool. Anyway. I love the Winter Spell. Now, you see that it can do, like, 180 points of damage. Uh, all the monsters in here have... Well, no, it's not really resistance, but they're they're affected by fire and ice elements uh, by 75%. <laughs> so they have 25% resistance. But yeah, another awesome thing about this is that it has a 25% chance of casting Solidify on an enemy, which nothing in the game resists, <laughs> which is awesome, which uh, will prevent them from doing anything for a turn. And then this will hit a row of enemies, which I'll show off eventually, probably. 80 points, or not so much in this dungeon, but, uh, okay, I do want to fight you. Actually, yeah, let's hit him with Dinky real quick. Just to show that off. Wow, that was a... Ha! You're still not gonna hit me, huh? What else can you do? That spell's 100% accurate, by the way, and it still has, uh... Alright, what was I going to say? Yeah, and it's still extremely low cost, which... Oh, I think he got a level up. Sweet. Oh, Flash Alpha! Alright, cool. About time we got that. Offense, Vitality, need that. IQ, need that. Yeah, since she gets IQ quite a lot, she'll often, you know... I, <laughs> I just got my MP back, essentially. And we got Magic Shield Alpha, which we'll need later. It will block magic, any magic attacks for two turns, if you use it once, you know, for one character. Uh, but, uh, oh, no, no, no. Alpha! Not so much this one, but the later variations of this are potentially some of the most abusive and most powerful spells in the game, although it's not terribly likely. We'll get to that later, but yeah, this this one here has a 7 and 8 chance of causing uncontrollable crying, which is this game's version of blind, uh, and a 1 and 8 chance of making them feel strange, which is this game's version of confusion. So, uh, anyway, another one. Oh, you know what? I just thought of something else that I totally forgot about. We got the sing ability, which I don't 
really like using. It's when you use this, it's very it has a rather random effect. You have a 5 and 16 chance of like healing very low amount of HP. I forget exactly how much, but uh and then, otherwise, you know, you have a couple other levels of healing that could potentially do, but there's also a series of, like, four negative effects that it could potentially have on both you and your enemies, like, well, casting Flash Alpha, for example, or uh, casting hypno a Hypnosis and Brain Shock spell that does not take your uh, resistance into account, so it has 100% accuracy. It's kind of scary. I haven't listened to this song for that long. Oh yeah, that's another thing I actually I actually learned a lot of things over the weekend because I finally found a uh, uh, algorithms for this game. But it turns out the stuffed toy there uh, it it will take 75% of all attacks, <laughs> which is crazy. Whereas the party ta has a well, it, uh, has a 25% chance of being targeted otherwise. <laughs> anyway, we should learn a spell here. On this level, right? Or, no, uh, it must be the next level. Anyway. Where are the bats? I usually meet the bats around here. Oh, well. Oh, I finally didn't get a level up. Sure love the winter spell, though. And I also love uh, what's in this. The sweater! Which, uh, I think it was called the Great... The Great Charm in the original? Or was that... No, it was this one. Anyway, the sweater... Must be equipped in your body. It protects you from paralysis. Uh, this is basically the travel charm and then some. It's Although it turns out the travel charm only gives you 50% resistance to paralysis, whereas this one gives you a 90% resistance. And uh, also it increases your defense by one, but it also adds five points of speed, which is awesome. Don't ask why, you're too cute to care! And I... Oop. Definitely want to give this to Sweetie Belle, who, besides needing all the defense she can get, is also uh, kind of needs a little, some speed, not just right now, but for later as well. So, you know, her defense is still lower by one point, but at least her speed's higher now. So, great. Oh, they're here. Yeesh. I don't really want to fight all three of those guys at once. Oh. Yeah, I'll fight you guys. Oh, for a second I almost thought I got in a red fight. <laughs> Dude, that was a little close. Mr. Batty, this is a good time to demonstrate the fire spell. This is a, yeah, it hits a row of enemies. Uh, if that mole had come in last time, it probably would have been in the back row. Uh, so I would have only hit this front row instead of, you know, what was in the back row. So it's sort of a multi... Yeah, they can do that. Yeah, it's sort of a, uh... Don't kill my toy! Jerks. Oh. Maybe I should have used the Winter Spell instead, but anyway, that's the Fire Spell. So yeah, it would have been more beneficial just to use the Winter Spell, which even costs less. Ha! Oh, cool. Hmm, running low on MP, eh? Let's let a level up fix that! Right? Good. Offense, defense, speed... Aw! No IQ? Dang it. But we get Storm Alpha! Which... Well, let's see. Storm Alpha, a spell you think would be really, really awesome because it does actually pretty good damage there. Costs even less than a winter spell. It uh, eliminates shields. <laughs> Literally penetrates and then eliminates them. And uh, there is nothing in the game that resists this. So you'd think it'd be awesome, except for it has kind of a bad miss rate. Essentially, it if there are fewer than four enemies in a battle, it will has a chance of missing. It's like number of enemies divided by four or something like that was the... Hey. Miss Ray. Oh, sweet. Another level up. Already? Oh, now I get my IQ. Haha, <laughs> I got my MP back. So I can now defeat the last mole who who's uh going to be back here again cuz I'm going to go and heal up real quick. Uh what's my doll taking like 30 points of damage? You know what? Sure, I'll I'll heal up Smarty Pants too by sending it to the uh, postal service real quick. So, all right, fully healed again, and this guy's back. But yeah, feel free to use the Winter Spell at your leisure throughout this dungeon. 
you'll pretty much never run out of MP. Oh man, again. Oh, now 10, offense, speed, guts, IQ, see? <laughs> You're always getting that MP with level ups. Let's see, what was I saying about that, uh, that storm spell? I don't ever use it because I very rarely am in a battle that has, uh, oh, more than one enemy in it. See? <laughs> or in the least, I'm very rarely in a battle that ha- oh, actually, you know what? I wanted to go up that way. Now, I'm very rarely in a battle that has more than two enemies. Oh, you're still there? Whatever. You're not that difficult. Actually, this guy, since he's alone... Ow! You actually got a critical hit? Seriously? Man! Jerk! That sucked. Well, it's not like I took that much damage. You're still there?! But yeah, seriously, other than that, uh, then like that, uh, that rat, that, uh, mouse or rat or whatever it was from back before, almost every enemy in the game has, like, a guts rating lower than 10. So, <laughs> it's always, dang it, shocking whenever they get a critical hit. Huh, another one. IQ? IQ? Oh, Oh, well. Oh, Winter Beta, and already we get the next variation of the Winter Spell, which is even, just in time, too, which is even more powerful. Slightly more than double the cost for double the power. It's so awesome. Yeah, barely costs anything extra. I love it. Uh, this is why I love the Winter Spells. I mean, there are enemies in the game that have very high resist. Seriously? Uh, <sighs> screw you guys, man. Man, I'm still so close to the entrance. I wasn't expecting to get this low on MP. Should I...? You know what? I've got that magic caramel just in case, so... Fine. Oh, dang it. Oh, well. It's not like... Well, this is a row, as you can see. So I might as well, you know, explain that. So, yeah, see? The fire spell here, I can't target both of them because they're in separate rows. So, anyway. We'll get to the, uh... Winter beta later. My plus toy! Die! Jerks. Yeah, later in the game when we have, you know, just boatloads of MP. Well, not really boatloads, but, you know, so much more MP. Oh, already? Yeah, we'll, uh, Sweetie Belle can just basically use the, you know, Winter Alpha instead of her physical attacks against your average monsters or just the other Winter spells in general, even. So. Anyway, now that we're over here, we can start meeting that bear that we've been kind of been seeing offhand. And also you. I don't want to meet the bear and you. Not that you're really that dangerous or anything, but... Now, you can defeat this guy with two winter... Uh, yeah, these, his sprite's been changed to reflect MLP a little better. But yeah, he you can defeat him with two of the winter alpha spells, but winter beta works so much better. And I'm totally going to have to use my... Uh, yeah! Yeah, because he only has 167 HP, so... Worth plenty of experience. Yeah, I'm not quite at the place where I can heal my MP yet, am I? Uh, especially with all you guys there. I might be able to pull it off. If not, I can just use that magic caramel. Dang it! I'm, like, so close! Okay, fu- Oh. Oh, well, it's just you. Run for it! Oh, he went right through me! Come back! Come back! No, not the... Man. <sighs> Fine. So close, man. So close. <laughs> oh, well, the mighty bear there has a 2 in 128 chance of dropping another... Uh, plush toy for you, so... Oh, wow. Nice, Sweetie Belle. I swear she gets that way more often than Paula ever did in the original game. Oh, wow. Vitality plus two? Holy crap! I needed that! Dang! Sweet! Wish I'd had that, like... Nope, don't disappear on me! Don't... Oh, yeah. Are we fully healed at HP? Ooh, it echoes! Anyway, this is the spawning location for the, uh... How much more MP do I need there? 
Yeah, spawning location for the magic butterfly. So... Oh, there we go. How much to our next levels, anyway? Yeah, it's a little ways, and... Well, I am at a decent enough level. Oh, good, I got full MP. I kind of would like to not fight any more enemies along the way if I can, because we're really close to the boss. But I might not be able to avoid it. Ha! Drat. You're e Well, you are easy. No, not a third one! Dang it. Ha! You didn't make it into the battle! But I know that there's a lot of bears that appear right up here. Oof. And you guys. Eesh! Ugh. It's not like I can't... It's not like I really need all that MP, so... Fine! Die, bear! I probably shouldn't shout, die, bear. You never know if Fluttershy's listening. Hmm. Could you get off screen there, please? Dang it, you're not gonna go off screen, are ya? I'm probably just gonna end up spawning more of you. Eesh. Yeah, I won't want to waste too much MP over here. Eee, that's worse. If I, okay, you know what? I'm satisfied with just the bear. Just give me the bear only. I'm, fi I'm fine with that. This is one of the few dungeons where it's difficult. Oh, yeah, that's right. There is another magic caramel. Yeah, where it's kind of difficult to make it to the uh, the boss without <laughs> with uh, full HP and MP there. But anyway, nothing down there, and we got rarity. Sweetie Belle! I guess I don't need to restore my MP. Well, actually... You know what? You know I will. Never mind. I am leaving. I got the, uh... Oh, I have croissant, too. Oh, I can heal... Uh... Where did I get that croissant from? Oh, one of the monsters must have dropped it. Let's see, who was it? The mole? Yeah, the mole playing rough is a 4 in 120 chance of dropping that, so... Perfect! Alright, sure, 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 why not? It's not like I'm ever going to use these anywhere else, and... I mean, I really don't use magic caramels very often. I'm surprised that I... Well, fought so many freaking moles while I was here. <laughs> I'm staying, Rarity! I defy you, I'm being a bad sister. Ooh. Rarity, or rarity, attacked. So, let's see, what was... First thing I want to do is I want to cast the Paralysis spell because rarity has a 99% chance of being affected by that. And it will prevent her from doing anything except cast magic. Which, unlike the original game, she can do. So I totally want to use the magic shield, starting with Sweetie Belle, because otherwise she'll cast her own uh, winter spell on us and pretty much kill you outright, or one of your characters, anyway. Ha! Alright, cool, cool. Uh, does she have, like, a, I think she has, like, a 50% chance of being affected by this, but I don't care about this point, so we're just gonna do that. Get one more magic shield on Dinky. Now, unfortunately, Rarity also has a, uh, is also only affected by the winter spell by, like, 25%, or she'll take 25% damage from it, so... I want to, well, for one thing, yeah, you use the fire spell or the bomb if you still have it. Because this will do good, de decent damage. Yeah, and then otherwise, I'm just going to use the fire spell, which I believe she has, like, it's, I think it's 50% or something. But, actually, you know what, I think this is, like, pretty darn close. to the Since I have the beta spell, it's actually pretty close to the amount of damage I can do. You know, I should have tested this out a little, uh, ahead of time. I kind of forgot exactly how much. Wow, she, she's not going to try casting a spell, is she? Not that it's going to really work. Actually, this is more effective, isn't it? No, actually it's not. Never mind. I was wrong. Or, rather, right the first time. Oh, she can cast Hypnosis? Oh, it's the first time I've ever seen her do that. Huh, what do you know? Oh, I'm out of MP. I don't care. I'll just hit her. <laughs> All right, then, then we'll just fire spell her, and because it's basically the best Sweetie Belle can do at this point. She's not very effective otherwise. Fortunately, Rarity returned to her chain. Or Rarity returned to her changeling form, so get lots of experience, nice level ups. Oh, baby! 
Ooh, nice level up. All right. I needed that IQ, man. I could have used that MP. Look at that. I had enough for one more. I could have finished her up right then and there. Ooh, we got life up beta. Sweet. Maximum HP. That's it. Oh, we got another one. I wasn't expecting that. Oh, speed, luck. Really? No MP? I'm shocked. Well. I actually got through this whole place with my... My toy still intact? That's the first. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> wow. Uh, flash beta. 300 HP. Very nice. And barely any more cost. Not even... Look at that. Not even double the cost. And for way more. For three times the effect. Sweet. So, anyway... The Chimes of Generosity! And we're fully healed. That includes homesickness, by the way, if you happen to have it. Oh. You know, it's kind of funny how Rarity, like... She's so into material possessions, despite being... You know, the element of generosity and all that. <laughs> it's just, it's, it's one of the, you know, cool quirks about her character. It's one of the things that makes her actually likable. Because <laughs> she kind of defies her own element. Are you supposed to run away from me now? Thank you. Ha! So, oh, actually, I could, man, that's a lot of them. I don't want to really get fight that many of them if I have to. So, now, yeah, you can see how Sweetie Belle kind of freaks out there when she's going this direction. Yes, nothing you can really do about that, but, okay, fine. Anyway, I'm gonna get out of here. Oh, wow. Well, that's actually not that dangerous. So, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and get out of here and we'll make our way back to Ponyville South next time on Let's Play Equestria Bound. Aw, oh, dang it. Well, anyway. Oh, I don't need to use the big one. <laughs> Arrivederci! Hey! Don't you dare make me lose my toy after I got all this way with it. We're crying out loud. Oh, wow. Oh. Well, thank you. <laughs> Two in 128 chance, man. <laughs>